thank you for joining to learn about Swipe Simple today. In this video, I will be showing you how to use the virtual terminal. The first thing that you would do is go to the Swipe Simple dashboard. And from there, when you're logged in, you can just click on the first tab called Virtual Terminal. It's uh, very easy to use. All you do is fill out the following fields. So the first thing is you'll just choose your mid. In this case, we just have one, Flatiron Farms. And then I can either put in card information, and uh, that includes cardholder name, the number, and so on. Or I can actually select a customer from my saved customer profiles where I might have a card on file. So I'm going to type in a new card. I can choose to save that card for later use if I want to. Just put in the number. I can enter an address for AVS to get lower transaction fees potentially. I can also enter a reference number, which is optional. However, if you would like the transaction to qualify for level two or three, you are required to put in a reference number. Otherwise, you can leave it blank. Line items, so if I'd like to track my inventory, I can choose from all of the items that I've saved from here, or I can just type in a new one and enter the amount and whether it's taxable. From there, I can choose if I'm going to put in one of my discounts, which would either be something that is um, saved as a dollar amount or percentage off, which of course is optional. And then I will choose a tax rate and I can save as many as I want. Once you filled out all this information, you would just hit charge and the transaction would go through. Thank you for taking time today to learn about the virtual terminal on the Swipe Simple dashboard. Thank you.